Hello everyone, I am Burger, and I'm here with another episode of Mountain Blade Game of Thrones, A World of Ice and Fire, and I'm here about to attack a caravan. See, I had done a ton of grinding off camera, and I was going to start doing some more interesting stuff. But then the game updated. The game updated. And that left me having to restart. So I cheated myself back to where I was in some ways, but there are other ways that aren't easy. So after I got back my gear and companions, I had to go and get married to uh, Warren Beesbury all over again, as well as start building up my renown. And leveling up my companions. So a lot of stuff I had to do. But now that I've done all of that, I am still above where I was last time. And now I am pretty confident about fighting weaker lords. Not quite able to fight a moderate lord, to be honest. Everyone spread out. Spread out. Am I still sealing them staying closer? Spread out twice. For Pete's sake. Press one button wrong once and then everything's off. And then march forward. So I have Thoros of Mir. I do not have Kyburn, but it seems like the update made all the companions like way, way better. And also way more expensive. So uh, I'm not really concerned about any of my companion skills because they have got immense skills. I've got a surgery of eight, a training of nine, uh, the companions are pretty strong. So I'm also confident to have less of them and not worry about it. Although I did seem to get a lot because, uh, I think I just kind of got lucky and found a lot. But next episode, my plan is to fight the Moon Brothers, uh, group of bandits. Uh, they are quite strong, actually, despite, uh, not having any shields. And, uh, really their main thing is numbers, and I just want to be able to best them as a rite of passage, just for my own standards. And just about there, and then I'll send my companions to charge. They still need shields. I managed to get them some horses, but then I realized, oh crap, none of them have any shields, like at all, ever. Hold right there. I also don't have a helmet for myself, which is something I can't help but keep forgetting about. I don't know what the deal is. I'm just really forgetful. I forget things like immediately after reminding myself to do them. I will not tell you how long it took me to get my companions in their uh, own group. Well, it seems like they're not taking any of them out. Come back. What's that guy back there? I have a spearman? Pfft. Spearman, go attack the infantry division. And now everyone can charge. After this, I'm immediately going to attack a lord. Darn it. Missed. And I missed there. Yeah, fight's over. My horse! How dare you attack my horse? Okay, they're all dead. I didn't get any. Oh well. This horse is kind of fat. It's a fat horse. I've also got a robber knight captain right there. He's incredibly strong. I hope he doesn't die right now. Knocked unconscious. Goody. Goody, goody, goody. Wow. There we go. They just took out one kill. Although it looks like I didn't deal the finishing blow. Well, I'm just using the sword. That's what I'm good at. Oh my god. Wow. Maybe I'm not good at anything. Or maybe I have the difficulty too high. 
I like maxed out all the difficulty. Because I thought it would make me stronger. I guess it is, just, you know, not very fast. Because, you know, I used to think I was really good at blocking and stuff, and then I realized that auto block was a feature. I didn't even know it was a feature, because I never looked up a guide even once. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. I also didn't know about uh, horses and speed, the relationship between them, for a long time. Goat and wolf meat. Very good. These armies sure are hungry. They can't eat uh, 150 before it goes rotten, but they can eat 50 before it goes rotten very well. And now I'll just go here really quick, see if there's anyone to sell these prisoners to. There is, in fact. Good, good. Trade with locals, goods. You know what? I'm gonna take this shield. I have a chicken on me. Sell that crap. And now let's find some weaker lord to attack. Right over here. And here we are. Tales of my courage and battles are told all across the known world. Your fame runs before you. Uh-huh. Surrender or die, even though you can't kill them. As far as I know, I wonder if you can kill them in this version. Hmm, that's an excellent question, now isn't it? Yes, I should ask it more often. Okay, so start with infantry, then archers, then cavalry. Then put the bodyguards in the front, then the horse archers. Do I have any horse archers left? It does not seem so. Oh, wait, I have one. Good. They're, uh, fodder. See, people on horses are really good at slowing people down to let the archers take care of them. So either fodder, like, uh, a shepherd, or people who can't die, like your companions, are really good at, uh, slowing everybody down so that your archers can kill as many as they can before they get close. And it seems they are charging like complete idiots, so this is a good advantage I've got here. Why are they turning that way? Can go a bit forward, I suppose. Forward! 50 paces! This is a lot more interesting than all those bandits I was fighting previously. Yep, send the companions to charge. Keep them busy. For just a few seconds is really helpful. Should have uh, had these infantry form into... ranks. Yeah, I definitely should have done that. Should get a little bit out of here. Archers fall back 10 paces. 10 more. And 10 more. Okay, we're good. There. These guys left. Have the shepherd, have the shepherd charge. I'm magnificent. That's what I am. Okay, see these guys seem to be out of range. I guess the Reach has really good archers though. I'm really pretty sure. At the very least, they're better than the Westerland archers. That guy is the Lord. Dibs! Dibs! Ah. Ooh, 
this infantry needs to charge. So should any remaining cavalry. Yep, well, they're busy with that. My archers will take care of them. Mallory's and Sterling's. This is good where it's gonna make or break it. It's my archers against theirs. And their archers can use, uh... Shields. But only when they want to. How did I miss that guy? Am I tall or something? Damn it! Okay, this is bad. Lost 30 renown. 49 killed. 104 killed. Okay. Well, this went poorly. One soldier will have to be sacrificed. That's fine. Okay, so that went poorly, but it did not go the worst ever. 30, 18, yeah. Just leave me alone. Hopefully it won't happen again. I really didn't want to do that. I really would have preferred not to, but... Let's see what I got left. Okay, so these guys can all get upgraded. I've got a lord on me already. That's how I knew I could beat one. Like, at all... How many man-in-arms do I have got? Still got 20. That's not terrible. Uh, I need to regroup. I can recover from this. Uh, you know, sometimes when you lose a battle, all the progress you've gotten is gone. That's what I was getting for a long time in these videos. Is uh, every battle I would lose too much progress. You know, those uh, Iron Man pirates are not the safest to fight. But, uh... In this scenario, I think I'm doing pretty decent. Now, does the wolf meat and goat meat not go bad? Am I misunderstanding that? In any case, I'm going to return to High Garden and then to Honey Colt. The caravans are pretty safe for me to raid, but as you saw in the beginning of the video, they were a little too safe. I wanted to do something a bit more interesting. But, you know, it seems like I didn't, you know. Is Mander still needing my help? Yeah, I don't want to lose any people because I'm using the combined leadership from each and every one of them. See, I need all that room in my army with their combined leadership. If I'm going to best these lords, so I can't let any of them get away. But, you know, things he just wanted to leave because things were going pretty poorly. He actually doesn't hate a lot of my companions. There are just a few companions that everybody hates, like uh, Sir Illifer the Penniless. He thinks he's better than everyone else. And Brawn is a complete asshole. Now, I do want to hear some puking noise. Love the puking noise. Okay, how, how healthy is my army? Eh, decent. Just go to Honey Holt. Honey Colt. Is what I call it for some strange reason. I actually have no idea why I call it that. That's all you got for me? Bastard. Not giving me any good stuff. I wonder when they're next going to offer me money for this lord I've captured. Who do I have? No idea who that is. Too many characters. Can't keep track of them all. Deer herd? Eh. Mander. Okay, it seems they don't need my help anymore. Just as well, I suppose. House guard. I can get a bunch of reach knights really soon. I should keep my eye out for that. I'm gonna head up to Winterfell to do some trading. And I'm gonna attack some bandits on the way. No, if I come across of a group of like 50 or more.
Sons of the Mist? Don't know what that is. But since I will be passing through the twins, I have to look out for the Moon Brothers, which is a very large bandit group. Mercenary group, actually. It's a hill tribe mercenary group. You can actually hire them. But I'd prefer to kill them all. Northern Clansmen, Wolf Pack, eh. So has this gone rotten at all? It's been eaten. Okay, locals, goods. Ah, yes, good to see this is still cheap. They change around the... What's it called? Trading quite a bit, as you would imagine. Well, that's all I got room for? Damn. Okay. Down to salt pans. I didn't realize that that place was a city. Not all of them look like cities. A lot of them just look like slightly bigger castles. You are not going to offer me more money for this guy, are you? Fine. i rather accept the money now rather than lose him later. Good. It doesn't cost much money to let him stay. As long as you can afford it, I recommend doing that option so that uh, they're easy to convince to stay. Oof. Morale's low. I don't want to lose any ma more mounted sergeants. So I'm going to wait here for the night. I'm finally going to let them sleep for the first time in, like, months. There we go. 31 morale. That should be enough to keep them from deserting. Go to the inn. What we got here? Merchant. Drinking contest. Peasant. I'm not sure I can afford anything. Oh, right, I got that shield. I'm just gonna try a shield. These can be used on horseback, it seems. Tower shield. They're more expensive. I'm just gonna go for an old heater shield, because I really think my companions need some shields. And trade with the locals. Let's see what we got here. Horse merchant. This horse merchant does not have a lot of money. I went to one horse merchant that had over 10,000. I don't know why this one has so little. They got some nice helmets here. I'm going to have to keep that in mind. Look, this one has a crown. That looks cool. It's kind of expensive, though. I need to keep in mind uh, that I've got a big army that costs about 5,000, give or take another thousand every single week. Now I've got his leadership maxed out within reason, so I'm just gonna get him some shield riding skill so I can get him a better horse at some point. Okay, his leadership is maxed out within reason. Strength, give him power throw. You should give all your companions a spear, a one-handed weapon and throwing weapons of sorts that's just my opinion though I don't know what like official guides would say okay if I give him one intelligence I can give him two leadership but I don't think I need that much leadership at that is exact moment people seem to be okay with dick crab it seems like only one person didn't like him just keep that shepherd around his fodder. Now I've got all this money I should keep in mind. Yeah, all, all these footmen are ready. And now how many men in arms I have? 37? That's pretty good. I'm, I'm comfortable with that. So there, my army is now considerably better. But these reach knights are going to be super expensive. It's nearly 2,000 per unit. That is extremely expensive. And they're going to be expensive to upkeep as well. So I'm just going to see and wait to see if I can get some better money at another time. But next time you see me, I will be fighting the Moon Brothers. Because I need to do some stuff off camera because I've spent enough time fighting bandits. No more bandits for me. I'm only drinking the good stuff from now. 
The good Kool-Aid. I'm only drinking the good Kool-Aid from the, the cult I'm in. That's it for today, everyone. Bye!